Here's the deal. We really appreciate your support. It becomes more counterproductive. Thank you. Better off not even In the Bill of Rights. Do you need psychiatric help? This is for CPS. I'm serious. It just seems like you're a little off right now. How's it going, guys? Good. What are you guys working on today? Working on it? Yeah. We're doing security. You're doing what? Station has security. You guys are responsible for protecting the officers in there? Before 730. Yes, what? I just want to know where my tax money is going, making sure the public servants are doing the right thing. Of course, yeah. Yeah. So we are protecting the guys inside. Are they unarmed? Have a nice day, sir. Yeah. Are you trying to dismiss me? Yes. Well, that's not going to happen. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm doing my job, so have a good one. Well, I'm just I'm being polite, asking a question. You actually work for me, sir. You can stay as long as you like. I know I can. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to ask you gentlemen one more thing. How seriously do you take your oath to the Constitution? Well, I just want to let you know that men, women, and children have given blood, sweat, and tears for the Constitution. You can, you can put, you guys took an oath before God, even if you're an atheist, before your fellow Americans to the Constitution. Now, I've had the mayor and the governor have illegal curfews, we've had checkpoints, we've had churches shut down, funerals broken up, right? These are all anti-constitutional. Yeah. Can you please give me some space, sir? <laughs> are you guys going to continue to follow unconstitutional orders, or are you going to do what's right and be on the right side of the American people, or would, are you guys going to be redcoats? <laughs> How seriously do you take your oath to the Constitution, ma'am? Can I have your name and badge number, please? Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me, ma'am. Would you tell that to a judge? Can I have your name and badge number, please? Would you say that to a judge? Is, is that what you do to a judge? So these guys, they all have weapons, but they have to protect the guys inside with the weapons. These guys took an oath to the Constitution, and they can't be bothered to talk about the Constitution. These guys are modern-day tyrants. These guys are modern-day redcoats. What's your problem? My problem is these gentlemen right here swore an oath to the Constitution. Sir, they're they're heroes. heroes. Sir, don't worry about it. Did they or did they don't not swear an oath to the Constitution? I don't know what they did, but they're heroes. They're protecting you. So what's your problem? Their job You're is... You're probably a coward. Oh, well... What do you do for your work? Well, I do a number of things for work. But my, you my problem is I protect the Constitution. These gentlemen swore an oath... Life these, these gentlemen swore an they oath to the Constitution. They laid down their lives to protect they people. You're These guys didn't take an oath to the Constitution? No, they don't have to. No, they don't. They don't have to take an oath to the Constitution? Listen, here's the deal. We really appreciate your support. Step back, step back. Step back. It becomes more counterproductive. Thank you. Step up, step up, Thank you. The problem. Better off not even bothered. Right. Right. We do appreciate it. Yeah, cool, cool, cool. No, I'm, I'm, I'm making sure the people that I pay uphold the Constitution and the Bill of Rights. And they don't do it. And they laugh at me when, when I talk, talk to them about their oath. They think it's a joke. Doug, they take an oath to the Constitution. Every public servant takes an oath to the Constitution. These gentlemen... You're a judge. Did you elect me? I'm not a judge. I'm, what are you talking about, Doug? I'm just trying to... They bring them to oath. I will bring them to oath. That's the whole point. They have a right to bring them All right, can I, can I politely... Sir, allow me to retort. Please don't touch me, sir. Please don't touch me. Please, no, you don't touch me. Is this a restricted area? No, so there's, there's the lobby. I'm fine. That guy can stand there. We're all standing here. Then why are you here? You shouldn't you be solving crimes? Why are you hanging out instead of solving crimes? I'm backing up. I, I mean, well, as, as this gentleman told me and that gentleman told me, I'm well within my right to stay here. There's not a restricted area. I'm free to stay. I'm free to go. You are over there, not in front of the door. I'm not in front of the door. I'm not even close to front of the door. Can I have your name and badge number, sir? Right here. Would you tell that to a judge? It's on your chest right here. What? What? What are you getting my back is it, is, it, is it not your policy to identify yourself? Fully, Thank you very much. So, so. Thank you. Thank you. Step out of my way. Do not come over here. See what I'm holding? Why? Step out of my way. I'm out of your way. I'm behind you. Thank you. Thank you. They're Look, holding, I'm I'm leaving. Holding. I'm you, leaving. Sir, do sir. you need psychiatric help? This is for no, I'm being serious. I, 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 it just seems like you're a little off right now. Okay, Can we well, get you to a hospital? Do, 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 do you need medical psychiatric help? Do you have a place to stay? Because you seem to want to stay here all day. Do you want to stay I'm, here? I'm you actually, need a shelter. Sir, I'm actually on my way, but do okay, you think do you so think the Constitution is mental in, in, institutionalized? I didn't say it was. I'm, I'm talking about the Constitution. Please don't touch me. 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 Please don't touch me.
Yeah, you guys are red coats. You guys sworn oath to the Constitution. Yeah, and, and you're and you're actually red coats. You sworn off to the Constitution. You're laughing about the Constitution. You're calling people who stand up for the Constitution saying they have mental illness. Sir, you're on the wrong side of history. You guys are the ones shutting down funerals. You guys are the one with the checkpoints. You guys are the one with the mask. You guys want to shut down the business. I I will have a good day. Oh yeah, and you know what? During World War II, just following orders didn't cut it. The people that did that were hanged for treason. Owned. Take the walk of shame. NYPD walk of shame.